Sadio, so far this has been your most productive goal-scoring season of your career. What's really been the key to your form? And what's it like going head-to-head -head with Mo Salah for the golden boot back home? To be honest, I think my key form is uh, the squad. And uh, you can see that we help each other every single get every single game and we're giving everything we can as a team to get a, a positive result in the pitch so for the golden boot i think uh, you guys saying that <laughs> but uh yeah i think that's uh, very important for liverpool to have uh, players trying to to help the team scoring goals giving each other assists i think that's the more important for the golden boots you can Take it, we change with the league and the Champions League. You've also got the PFA Player of the Year in Virgil van Dijk, who hasn't been dribbled past in the Premier League so far this season. Can he replicate that against Lionel Messi tomorrow night? Sure. And we all confident, we know him, great players, great player. And uh, he's giving everything for the team and helping the team and let's you together and try to not be passing with <laughs> any of them and get the resu positive result here. Obviously, you faced Real Madrid in the final last year. How does this compare in terms of the, the challenge that the Barcelona side will, will pose you tomorrow? <laughs> to be honest, I think, um, yeah, it was for us a really, really good experience because it was the first first time for each of our players to, to, go, to play final. So, yeah, of course, you know, we love to win, but we face one of the best team in the world and they deserve to win so let's go and use this experience for tomorrow night and try to to get the positive result here uh, Sadio Roberto for me now back in training today is it possible to say how important he is for you for the team to be back fit again of course we're really happy to, to see him back because it's a really important player for us and uh, it's helping the team a lot, and that's great. And yeah, we are very happy to, to see him. You, your goal scoring record at the knockout stages in Europe is incredible. Every single time you score in the knockout stages, does something change? Does it, is it more exciting when it's a knockout part of the group? Say again, sorry. In knockout stages of the competition, so not the group <coughs> games, the knockout stages like now, yeah. you've scored in every game. Oh, really? <laughs> does, does something change for you? Does it, is it more exciting for you? To be honest, I think uh, nothing changed and just excited. And hopefully tomorrow so we'll score for the team and <laughs> pass through. And just finally for me, Philippe Coutinho looks likely to play tomorrow, a former teammate of yours. Is it possible to describe what kind of a player he is and how you feel about playing against him? To be honest, to describe how he is, I think uh, maybe will be, I will get misled because have, you know more than me <laughs> because you watch more. <laughs> great, great player and um, I'm a little bit jealous to Barcelona and get him because I would love to see him. <laughs> But yes, yeah, part of football, we are happy for him. I think um, he really enjoyed playing <coughs> alongside of his teammate and giving everything. And he's still young and for sure will do, if, improve a lot because I know him, he's a hard worker. And that's it. And hopefully tomorrow he will be still in the bed. <laughs> <laughs> when we play. Hi, Mane, for Tres Media España. Quería preguntarte en Spanish, si es posible. Eh, mañana vas a jugar en el Camp Nou un partido de Champions. ¿Te gustaría jugarlo alguna vez eh, en un partido de la Liga Española? Dicen que el Real Madrid le, le gustas mucho. Oh, very good question. I think you guys uh, write it. I really like all other of my friends, so <laughs> I respect the league and it's good league and they have great players, but uh, I think Premier League is also a wonderful league and every single player will love to play there so um, I have chance to play there I'm very happy so I think that's cool okay. uh, <coughs>
uh, Sadio, I believe when you were young, your friends used to call you uh, Ronaldinho when you played football. Yeah. Uh, can you t tell us a bit about that and how much of an inspiration he was to you and what will it be like for you to play here at the Camp Nou where he played? Oh, good question again. Ronaldinho, when, for me, was... It, Ronaldinho was my hero, one of my heroes. And uh, I love, really love watching him playing. And especially it was here, isn't it? <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> it was Camp Nou. So, yeah, for me, this dream become true. I would love maybe to play against him, but yeah. Let's say it tomorrow is not here. Maybe adventures for us. And uh, to be honest, uh, still, still love him. Still love him. And he's still my uh, hero forever. What was it about him that you, you, you really liked? His skills. Uh, smiling for sure. Maybe I'm not smiling on the pitch. <laughs> People think I'm angry, but I'm not really like this. I will love to have his smile, but uh, I think we are not similar on this side, so that's it. <laughs> Buenas tardes, Sadio. Bienvenido. Eh, ¿Crees que mañana... Sí. ¿Piensas que mañana se enfrentan las dos mejores delanteras del mundo para muchos, Messi con Suárez, Coutinho o Dembélé, y la vuestra con Firmino, contigo, con Xalá? ¿Alguna crees que es más fuerte que la otra o crees que son las dos mejores, los dos mejores ataques del mundo en estos momentos? Wow, what a compliment. We are the best in the world, one of the best, so really happy for us to hear them. So, to be honest, it's always, um, for us, it's a compliment and at the same time it's a motivation for us to compare this kind of players. And, uh, yeah, so I think it's going to be, a, again, another motivation to give everything and to win against those best players in the world. Sadio, Sadio, aquí, hi, well, no, 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 I, I yeah, oh, I'm making sorry. English. Um, what do you feelings about Camp Nou? Do you think the the feelings about Camp Nou? Do you think that it's an, a normal stadium or uh, half a, a mystic? Oh, I think it's a wonderful, <laughs> wonderful stadium. I've been watching Barcelona since I'm young and still watch uh, La Liga sometimes. And all of us, for sure, because we, we are football players, we love to watch football sometimes. And yeah, for us, it will be. But anyway, we're used to it because Anfield is unique, huh? to be honest. <laughs> so yeah, I think uh, it will be great for us to, to play this kind of stadium because for sure, every single player will love to play this kind of stadium. And But without making ourselves pressure, to be honest, I think motivation for us. <laughs> to play there and give everything, get a positive result here. Yeah.